On today's show, actor and teacher Ron Michelson. We take a tour of the Orange County High School of the Arts. And we're out on the street to see what's up, Orange County. Some commercials entertain us. For our segment we call What's Up on the Street, we ask, what commercials entertain you? Progressive commercials? Those are really hilarious to me. I love them. I, th I think Jack in the Box has great commercials. Geico, that you can't get them out of your head. I remember the Budweiser commercials with the frogs. The Coke Zero commercial. I would say the Gab commercials, just because of the dancing. Traveler's commercial with the doggies trying to hide the bone. I don't do commercials because we TiVo everything and I fast forward through the commercials. Budweiser commercials from the frogs and the lizards. The Diet Tech commercial with that lone guy. I like the YoPlate commercial. <laughs> the one with the... It, she wore an itty bitty titty with a yellow book of top bikini. <laughs> He is an actor who has appeared in over 500 commercials, numerous television shows, and movies. Please welcome Orange County resident, Ron Michelson. Hey, Ron, it's great to have you here. Hey. Now, um, how long have you lived in Orange County? I've lived here a long time. What, a long time? That's well, right. Is that over a couple months then? Uh, no, that would be probably 20 plus years. Great place to be. Actually, no, that makes it 30 plus. But I'm only 27, so how could that be? I, I was trying to figure out how it could be possible that you did 30 years when you're looking like 21 I to me. Know. Cosmetic um, surgery. Is it cosmetic it is. surgery? Absolutely. That's what they say Orange County is known for That's it. That's right. I could give you the name of a good doctor if you like. Oh, please. <laughs> Let's I think, compare. I think you do need them. <laughs> now, I've noticed that <clears throat> I've seen you on TV. Like I said, 500 commercials. That's amazing. Really? I don't know. What is the trick? <laughs> what is the magic? What is it that keeps getting you cast over and over again? I'd like to say my talent. Right. It's. I think it's the look. I think it's I sleep with every casting director is that, in Hollywood. That's where I went wrong. Really? Yes. Can you tell the audience out there some of the commercials that we maybe have seen you in before, sir? If I said them, then I might have to kill you. But why don't I just pick the highlights? Okay. What are a couple of the highlights? Let's see. I don't know. Ditech might be one. Yeah, Ditech, 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 and a couple other ones. Have you done any kind of food commercials or anything where possibly you'd be eating anything? I have. Is there a trick to eating on camera? There is. What is the trick? Are you going to keep it to yourself? Well, depending on the commercial, it might not be real food that you're supposedly holding. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Well, how long have you been making commercials? Oh, about as long as I've been in Orange County. About 20 to 30 years then. <laughs> Do you remember the first commercial you ever did? Shall I tell it to you? I guess I have to actually, I know where I need to go with these questions. I need to f just basically go right in for the kill. Name the a commercial that you've been in, please. A commercial or the I'd first like a couple commercial. so we can know that you're not just a one-hit wonder, okay? <laughs> so let's go. Oh, do you want to go alphabetically mean, or by how much the one paid you? Wait a second, I'd like to okay. go back to one-hit wonder. One-hit wonder, yes sir. Let me hear the one hit. Do you sing too? No. We but don't know that. Uh, you know what? I can't wait much longer. I need to have everybody see a clip of this amazing but I have Michael so Mitch commercial. To say. Please, sir, we've got to show it. We've got to show it. And here it is. You'll kick yourself for not trying it sooner. Ow! We're celebrating our maleness and answering that little voice Aww. inside. Denny's has new manly sized meals. For all of us who can be a little hard on how we see ourselves. Well, keep up the good work. Eat as many of these as you can before they find out what they're really worth. You know, son, interest rates have changed. I know, Mom. I'm a loan officer at the bank. So I've decided to refinance the house. Okay, I can help you. I'm calling Ditech.com. Mom! I lost another loan to Ditech. They got to see the amazing work. That first one was what, Raisin Nut Brand? Raisin and you're Nut looking Brand. Young there. Very young, very thin. I have a story about that. Okay. Do you notice when people eat on camera, they rarely swallow? Because after 70, 80 takes, you get rather full. 
They told me in this because I was kicking myself and going ow and all that, I would need to swallow. They would have no, what is called a spit bag for me. So, two tablespoons of raisin nut bran cereal, each take dry, no milk, <laughs> 44 takes, 88 tablespoons of Raisin Nut Bran cereal. That was in about 88, I believe. I'm still regular today. <laughs> um, do you think the reason you had to do so many takes was because of you? Or was Absolutely it not. I was you. brilliant in every single take. Uh. But if, you, if you looked at it closely, this is before computer-generated CG, all this. This was like super edgy Tricky. right at the time. I noticed you played twins there and then now you on the last one you were like the mother and the son and you were I was trying to decide if you were looking better as the mother or the son. Well all truly talented actors have been in drag at one time. Oh okay. Just think about that. Robin Williams. Right. That's a good idea. I haven't tried it and I don't think I will. <laughs> But if it gets me apart, maybe for Die Tech. You know, I no, was wondering, Die Tech, I saw you for well, a long right. time on those commercials, That's and right. I was wondering if possibly, because that loan banker, Ned, is he one of the reasons we've been having so many financial problems? I'm not going to go that far to say that, but once I left the airwaves, did you happen to notice what happened in the mortgage business? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Coincidence? I think not. Everybody out there, mm -hmm. if you would have kept him on the air, Mm -hmm. We might not have had this problem with the market. Mm -hmm. Now, you also are a teacher. I am a teacher. And where do you teach? Well, I have taught at many places because I can't keep a job very long <laughs> yet. <laughs> uh, I have my own workshop in Tustin. It's called Orange County Commercial Acting Workshop. I also teach at Fullerton College, both... Uh, teaching an improv class and acting for the camera class as well as an intro class. Have taught at Santa Ana College, Santiago Canyon Colleges as well in now, Orange. Now for that commercial actors workshop, is there a website that they can get more information about it? I just happen to have one. Would you? Indeed. Where's my camera? Is this my... Hello. It's www.occaw.com. That was pretty much. Uh, you were so sad good. I was wondering if yeah. you'd come to every filming and maybe you could do the intros for the show because I'm a little weak at the beginning, I've been told. Actually, I think I could be the host. Uh, hey. There, I said you did numerous television shows. And I have done Golden Girls, <gasps> which I was, again, young and thin, even younger and thinner than in the commercial you just showed. Uh, I recently did an Entourage episode. I love that. Uh, Arrested Development. Guess who I played in Arrested Development? Uh, I don't know. I played myself. Oh, my goodness. And you were also a Jeopardy question at one time, weren't you? Something with Jeopardy. Actually, which is amazing. I was a live clue on Jeopardy. A live clue? Yes. When they finally picked a category and dollar amount, which by the way, it was $1,200 in double jeopardy. I would have been insulted if it was 200 Yet, uh, when I, uh, they called uh, my question, I walked on stage, looked right to the camera, and said, oh, I lost another one to that well-known mortgage company. <laughs> <laughs> to which somebody, of course, beeped in and said, And they got the answer? Ditech. What is Ditech? Exactly. I know there's a lot of scams out there. Is there anything that you can help with those young aspiring actors to watch out for? It does not cost a lot of money to get into this business. Anytime you hear about somebody holding a big seminar or thousands of dollars and we can get you into the business, this is the best thing known to mankind. Don't go. Don't go. It is a ripoff. You do not need to do that. It is history. Now, Just take a class, know where to get your photos done, uh, write the first time, get educated of the business, and then uh, you're ready to go.